What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's Hudson Hiker and today we are going to be doing the most iconic places. Let's get to it. The Walnut Street Bridge is a historic iron and steel bridge that spans the Tennessee River in Chattanooga, Tennessee. It was constructed in 1889 and completed in 1891, but fell into disrepair and was reconstructed in 1933. Today, it is a historic monument of Chattanooga achievement. Rock City officially opened as a public attraction on May 21, 1932. I got, it got off to a slow start because advertising in those days was difficult especially since Mr. Carter Garner's attraction was not located in a place that people would just happen to pass by and visit. The solution was to paint a farmer's barn with three simple words on it. See Rock City. Throughout the years, Rock City gardens have become a true American icon. Rock City's mission is to create memories worth repeating. With its famous and long history, Rock City Gardens has earned its reputation as a world-class destination and promises to be for years to come. The Chattanooga Chuju is a historic monument special to downtown Chattanooga. It was a terminal for a famous train station, and today it is a hotel where people can rent out a train car from the 1800s. A unit of the Chickamauga and Chattanooga National Military Park located on Lookout Mountain, the site of the Civil War battle commonly referred to as the Battle Above the Clouds, when the South soldiers tried to take control of the gateway to the South. The visitor center houses a mural painted by James Walker, an eyewitness to the battle and has several short presentations about the painting and Battles of Chattanooga. In 1930, Leo Lambert, along with a small crew, entered an opening to explore a newfound cave. They found unusual and beautiful rock formations. They named it Ruby Falls and created a beautiful attraction. From 1930 to 1935, tours were offered, but Ruby Falls proved to be the most popular. After a century of tours through Lookout Mountain, Ruby Falls is loved by generations of guests. The first incline on Lookout Mountain opened in 1887. The second incline, engineered by John Krauss, opened November 16, 1895. And this, and this is the incline that is still in operation today. Electricity was only used after 1911. This year, a new pair of cars were installed in the incline in March 2020. The entire project cost a total of $4 million and included upgrades to the rail cars. But one thing for sure, the incline is iconic. All these places are really important to Chattanooga. Thank you guys so much for watching. And remember to subscribe down below, hit that notification bell, and drop a big thumbs up on this video. Hudson Hiker, signing out.